Hello, ladies and gentlemen! What are you doing? It's cold out there. Are you crazy? Get inside. Get inside. What are you doing? What are you doing? Jesus! I should just greet everybody who knocks on my door from now on with a big hello, ladies and gentlemen, and just freak them out. How rude would that be? But welcome, goats, to our brand new house! I don't know why I showed you this room first because by far it is the dirtiest and it will only get better from this point on. Uh, I, I don't, this is all stuff that we need, but we haven't got to yet. I don't know what to do with this room. I kind of want to just put one big huge statue there and be a boss. Kelly kind of wants a library. I don't know. What, what should we do with this room? I'll let us know in the comments down below. I, I, what if I started hoarding and I like hoard this whole room up that goes all the way up there. I got a chandelier. Isn't that crazy? I don't know how to change those light bulbs. I don't know how to do it. How do I do it? I should turn off the lights so I won't have to change them ever. But I, I said our house because without you guys, without my goats out there, the goat army watching my videos, supporting them, and just supporting me as a person and putting up with my silliness and randomness, this is impossible. And I, I'll show like the house of details, uh, but but I think that I think this is just so crazy that I want to talk about it for a little bit, and I'll go over the house in, in, in a bit. But th like without you guys watching my videos, this wouldn't be possible. But I never thought when I started pointing my camera at a TV and filming. I was gonna say a camera like this one, but a camera way crappier than this one, like a one megapixel uh, camera with a camcorder function. I never thought it would come to this and my life would be like it is today. And it's such a, a crazy, right? It's so, it's so crazy. And, and like, I, I know there'd probably be a lot of like comments and, and, and stuff, so I wanna clear a few things up. Uh, this, this house is just paid for from YouTube and YouTube related things. I, uh, I didn't have any money before I started YouTube. I was on food stamps and to come this far is, it's, it definitely is life changing. It's, you know, YouTube is a huge part of my life and I absolutely love every second of it. And it, it and it's, a, it, it's, it's awesome. And I just want to Say to if there's any people starting on YouTube or whatever you want to do, and it doesn't have to be YouTube, but you can do it. Because if I can do it, I know you guys can do it. Because I I came from a place that wasn't very good at all, not good at all, and I came a long way. Just I didn't have much, but I had one thing. I had one thing, and that was determination, and that that was like a goal. That was just a drive to to make a better life for myself. And and you can do it. It's not going to be easy. It wasn't easy for me, but it. You know, it's a crazy ride, ride, and I'll never forget this time in my life because with, with purchasing this house, I like this, this isn't just like a, oh, it's a nice house. This is a really good investment. This is gonna be here. Even when YouTube is long gone, I'll still have a house and I'll still have, you know, a place to sleep and, and stuff. And, and uh, you know, it, I, I never was flashy with my YouTube money. I want to, okay, can I do this? I want to do this. Let me get one, like, YouTube money! Okay, I just wanted to get an echo. Uh, <laughs> I, like, I, I bought a used car. I didn't buy watches or anything fancy. I bought, you know, I bought socks and maybe a few pairs of shoes and a bunch of goat t-shirts, but that's about it. Uh, you know, I was really smart with my money. I saved up. I did buy props, a lot of props too, and, and stuff for, video equipment and you know I saved up was really smart with my money and since you know the economy isn't in the best place right now I got a really really good deal about how 37 percent off I believe was a exact number from like when it was first built in uh, I believe 07 or 06 so it's you know it's a really new house new equipment new everything I got a really good deal on it and I'm happy I'm really happy because I was you know I was on in the ghetto for so long, longer than I needed to be. Like I could have moved out to a nicer place well, well, way long ago. But I I, I saved up and I bought a, a, a dream house. This is truly a dream house. And it's, you know, it's, it's I, I'm happy. I like it, I really like it. So let's, let's show it off, all right? So uh, this is the dining room, which I really never use. Uh, we, we play board games occasionally. I haven't ate 
on here yet. That's a pretty nice china case. You can see me. Um, nice little chandelier. I don't think this picture <laughs> is supposed to go in this room. Kelly and her mom bought a whole bunch of um, different paintings and I just wanted to hang it up. So th what I like about this, this is kind of cool. Cha ching Like lights up the lights. So yeah, that's that. Uh, I, should, I should let you guys know that we are not like finished. I st we still have to put up a lot of paintings, but uh, like we moved in right before Black Ops 2 and then that controlled a lot of my life. This is kind of the entrance, what you see, there's some, uh, my socks right there, my toe. Uh, a little rug. I want another rug right there and a rug under uh, that table. But this is the, ooh, this is a, the entrance, what you see. Do you put things on these walls? These walls are so big, I just don't know what to do with them. Um, that leads up to the master bedroom and other bedrooms upstairs. So I'll get into that later. Nice little, I don't know, oval office. It's oval. It's a nice circle little room. Uh, I want to put a rug, like I said, and maybe a plant on top of that table. Right now, usually I just put my, my junk and stuff. This is one of my favorite rooms in the house. And why this is like one of the things that I was looking for. A two-story living room with a fireplace that was really open. And this is exactly what I wanted. And there's a a view of the the little lake out there and uh, the the fireplace is banging i never thought i was a person who would buy wood or water but apparently these these are both natural things that i could probably just go outside and get if i was a man but i would <laughs> i buy wood and stuff um there's portis plopping on his his uh bean bag and one thing i wanted to do about this house and one thing i really like about it is that it is comfortable like the floor I, I literally slept on the floor multiple times willingly because it's comfortable the couch is comfortable we can sit like three people four five six we can sleep like eight people let alone on this this couch and that's why i bought it because just in case the zombie apocalypse uh, i will be able to shelter my goats and uh, have you guys comfortable walking dead comic right there 60 inch TV, the surround sound right there, right there, right there. And uh, I know I have to fix it up a little bit. The cores are all over the place, but uh, it will be it will be fixed. A uh, little memorial. There's my, my graduation thing. Uh, this is a, a memorial for my, my parents. And there's Gilbert over there. We have uh, TV, surround sound, like I said, a big couch a rug tables and all types of type of stuff and it's open and it leads into uh the kitchen over there as well as this area up there so it's all it's really big really open nice fan to the to the openness of our, our view it's a lake and then like i don't know half a mile of just like farmland which is which is really nice to see the sunsets are beautiful here love them i love them so walking in to our kitchen we have our little eating table got a laptop and some fresh underwear on there i don't know why uh another chandelier i put those up i put those wine bottles up i don't think i ever drink them like these aren't special wines i just got them but just kind of for decoration i don't like wine too much but i put that up i put that stuff oh i think buddy put that one up but i put that one up put like decoration so we got a little decorations going on here in the kitchen Big granite countertop. Oh, look at that, look at that. Whoosh, 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 whoosh. A little dirty. Gotta clean it. Uh, you know, just just lot, lots of kitchen appliances stuff. A, a really nice kitchen, you know. I like to eat. I like to get my robe on. I like to eat. Let's see what we uh, got going in on the fridge. So, uh, let's see. Freezer first. Got some frozen pizza. I haven't changed. I have not changed one bit. I'm still eating the Jack's frozen pizza from the the pizza up and I'm still eating <laughs> I love that I love those man. so I got some pretzels down there uh, some more, more little frozen pizzas some chicken um, ice cream frozen fruit all types of stuff and uh, in here pineapple juice I got the, the raspberries just you know not the, the cleanest <laughs> the cleanest uh, the most organized refrigerator but by any means but it has lots of juices and stuff that I like to drink and uh, cats get out of there get out of there cat don't want to put you in the freezer um I mean you know cereal all kinds of snacks in there here's my gaming setup and I'll give you a, a quick little brief look in it I'll, I'll make a a separate video because there's so many different things that you guys uh, are gonna want to see 
in the gaming setup. So uh, that's kind of a tease, I know, but I'll, I'll go in because there's so many details that look over the gaming setup. And you guys, uh, I know you guys would want to see that, but I know you guys don't want to see like a 30 minute video. So here's like the shoe hallway leading in to uh, the living room again. Bunch of shoes. Um, I got more shoes upstairs and stuff. So let's head down to the basement, shall we? The basement is right this way. Oh, oh, that's where like my friends and uh, guest poop, uh, guest bedroom or bathroom. And then there's guest bedrooms upstairs too, but uh, that's where we poop. So, okay, let's go down, down to the basement. There's an RCXD right there for some reason. I have no idea. Don't judge me. YOLO. <laughs> I just put stuff all over the place. So, the basement. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh la la. Uh, one thing that I, I was looking for in a house was some... A house that would entertain me. And uh, I say that because I spend a lot of my time in my house doing YouTube and on the internet. But if I want to take a break, I could just go downstairs and be in my basement, which you can see right here. And a uh, pool table, really nice pool table. Uh, that stick, that thing gets in the way uh, on a few shots, but it's pretty nice. Pool rack, beer pong table. We haven't got to try that out. A green screen. Over here, and this is one of the coolest things. And I, I should do like a, a house tour 2.0 because it's not like set up. But that's uh, a goat that Kelly got me. That is a neon sign goat. I'll plug it in because it's cool. Ooh, ooh la la. And um, I didn't say <laughs> there's a lot of socks upstairs, and I didn't mention this. But uh, this is locked on. This is part of the music video. Uh, <laughs> Uh, yeah, I was shooting a stock music video and I never really uh, got to, to clean them up. So here is our bar that uh, is decked out pretty sweetly. What we're going to do right here is put a kegerator, which is a fridge with a keg in it. And I'm not a drinker by any means, um, but this is just to be a... I think it looks cool, one. And two, um, I don't know, it, it's fun to ha like host like little parties and stuff, have people down here. And... Uh, like, I'll drink with people. I'm not going to drink alone. I never uh, drink alone. But, yeah, so, bam, bam. Uh, nice, nice, nice bar stools. I, I think that they, they go perfectly with the, the black and the black granite and the wood and the wood. Uh, those didn't come with the house. We had to get, we pick those up ourselves. And, uh, yeah, so moving on to the bathroom. These lights don't work, but... You know, I improvise, I do what I gotta do, and there are lights. So this is the basement bathroom, which is really sweet. And uh, we just shot a porn, oh, right here. Uh, <laughs> no, that, that was another sock music video. Um, there's some socks in the background, as you can see, my hat and, and, and whatnot. But yeah, jacuzzi tub, it goes down. It, you know, you put some bubbles in here, some of this bubble bath, and it is beast. So, uh, this, this was a surprise. I didn't think this house would have it. Like, when I, I, I thought that, like, when they showed this picture, it was the, um, the master bedroom, or bathroom, but it's just a basement bathroom, and it's re it's better than the one upstairs. So, moving along, in here, this is my favorite room. Let's turn it on. What room is this? The theater room. Oh, shh. Wait, 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 hold on. Whoop! <laughs> I got the lights! I did it! I got the lights because, you know, I just had to get the lights. Uh, it was a little bit more, but I had to do it. So, uh, we got some of my favorite uh, series, Mad Men, Space Jam, uh, Heisenberg is, you know, uh, Breaking Bad, The Walking Dead over there. And we got one whole shelf of DVDs. I don't know how this, like, the guy beforehand, he had, like... Four shelves full of DVDs and the top two were like just cool, cool like movie related stuff. So uh, I'm working on that, but we did just finish one, one, um, one shelf. Whoosh, here's some movies if you want to pause and see what I, I like to watch. Uh, th uh, like I said, comfortable. I slept down here a time. I slept in this chair. I slept, you know, down here. Wherever you want to sleep, you can sleep in my house. Nice carpet. 
and whatnot. So the theater room is awesome. Uh, I spent a lot of time in here. We got surround sound. Uh, we actually got two surround sound systems <laughs> working for some reason. Uh, we got them in, in, in these little things, like up there. There's one over there. Like just all over the place, right there, right there. But we also got a like a Bose system too that is pretty nice. So that is the theater room. Let's take a, a stroll all the way upstairs and uh, to check out the master bedroom and like the guest bedrooms and stuff. So this is a fucking journey. Like 28 stairs, this is a motion sensor. Um, <laughs> So many stairs. I walked naked many times, like right here, going upstairs and downstairs, and I, I, don't, I wonder if those people got to see me. Um, so here's upstairs. Uh, we have three guest bedrooms and a master bedroom. One of the guest bedrooms Kelly uses for her office. I guess it's not a guest bedroom, but this is the one guest bedroom that is set up. Uh, we haven't had anyone sleep over here. We had a few guests, but they, they slept downstairs is more comfortable uh, or something I don't know um, so you know just a bed and stuff but it's cool uh, about this I have a another gaming setup if a commentator comes over and wants to uh, make a video or anything god damn you I have to change that uh, he can or she can there's a bathroom over chair and then to the master bedroom what I like to do every time I wake up every morning I like to come here, right out the master bedroom, master bedroom right there, and then just look over, look out to the land, and it's nice, it's really nice. Uh, the cat has not jumped down yet, but I know she wants to, I know she does, don't you cat? You're always, she always, like, this is the cat spot, like, the cats lay, love to lay right there, or right there, so, the master bedroom. Alrighty, so welcome into our bedroom. I don't believe in making beds. I think it's stupid. It's not more comfortable when you get in it. I don't get the whole making bed thing, but I kind of have made my bed to try to be presentable, but I don't believe in that. So here's our bedroom. Here is me in a mirror. Hi, I got penguin pajamas on. Uh, here is our view. Oh, I forgot that. I'm going to show you down there in a little bit. That is actually really cool. A really nice painting. I just don't know where to put it. Maybe there. This room is not finished by any means. Uh, I kind of want to put like a, a therapy couch right there. Like where you you tell all your problems to your therapist or or a psychologist or whatever. Maybe put a TV up there mounted. A nice whoop, 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 whoop. Uh, You know, just standard room, uh, bedroom type stuff. I, I like this set that we that we got. Big and grand. Like a some kind of king. Here is my closet uh i have fancy clothes look at me i got some fancy clothes um there's my my dress up stuff that i got like two uh, last year when i was going to all those events uh i like buying fancy stuff uh some goat t-shirts and stuff uh, my shoes the black ops two shoes that i think are pretty cool look at that bo2 uh, i got those i got the the straight bar shoes right there that's uh, some pants and, and stuff, uh, more shoes, and yeah, there's Kelly's closet. Here is the master, I have to change that light, bathroom, uh, little fruity chandelier there, uh, a nice shower. What I want to do with this shower is like add five more shower heads, so it's just like beastie. Put it like this, hello, there's a big echo, uh, it's... Really nice and big. That's a toilet room over there. Uh, big, big tub to soak in. A big soaker. A view to our neighborhood out there. And uh, yeah, that's you know his and her sinks. Let me show you what is really awesome that I said I would show you. Uh, I think it's pretty cool. And I'll show you the backyard too. So, guys, again, thank you for making this all possible. Watch my videos supporting them thank you a thousand million bajillion uh it it truly does mean the world to me and without youtube i don't know where i would be and i i absolutely cherish every moment of this youtube thing i love every single minute of it so thank you guys and even you know thank you 
to the haters who made this possible. You know the one thing that I find really stupid about a, a, a haters mentality is they hate on you for being successful. They don't want you to be successful, but they will hate on you. Right? I probably get a little hate on the, for, for some, like, it, it, it is stupid reasons, like un, unwarranted reasons. I'll probably get some hate for showing off my lovely house. But if you think about it, if you don't want me to be successful, why are you hating sending attention over to me and I get more success with the more views I get? Hater logic. Um, so let's go outside. So you go open these doors. That door. And here is the outside. We got a really nice patio. It's really cold out here, so I'm going to try to make this quick. Really nice patio. I got socks on. I'm going to get cold. I got to miss the, okay. The snow's lava. You can't touch the lava. Don't touch the lava. A dead turkey. Oh, there's a turkey suit over there. More snow. There's a lot of snow. Oh, don't get it. And right there is actually a hot tub that we have not used yet. We wanted to use it while when like the first major major snowfall happened but it never did and we got a nice uh, place out the back that you can that you can hide um, from the sun and there is the my view guys so thank you thank you for watching thank you for being a part of my life the sun's in my eyes I'm gonna walk this way my feet are cold but guys oh cat escape get in where are you going <laughs> I will have the gaming setup. I also didn't show you my uh, zombie setup, my uh, like the unfinished part of the basement. I'll include an annotation on the screen right now uh, if you missed that video. But guys, I love you for being a part of my life, making this all possible. Dream house, absolutely love it. I have so much fun here. It's uh, really nice. And I will see you guys later. Gaming setup coming soon. Bye.